Vampiros Lesbos is a West German Spanish erotic horror film directed by Jesus Franco. We open the film with a woman who has strange dreams of a lesbian vampire. When she goes to an island for a business meeting, she meets said vampire. The film stars Soul Dad Miranda. Howdy folks, welcome back to Garage vampire -thon, where every day for the month of October, we visit a vampire movie. If my opening was unenthusiastic, it's because I'm very unenthusiastic about this movie. Uh, this movie's terrible. This is the worst movie I've ever seen. Maybe not the worst movie I've ever seen, but it's not good. It's not good. Uh, bleh, it's not good. So, first of all, I have a problem with the title. So, the premise of this movie is that these vampires, they only can survive by drinking the blood of women. So, if they drink the blood of men, it doesn't do shit. They have to drink the blood of women. That doesn't make them lesbians. That makes them sexist. They can only drink women's blood. That doesn't sound like lesbian vampires. That's sexist vampires. This movie should be called Sexist Vampires. Uh, yeah. But the title and premise are the least of this movie's problems. This movie is just terrible. It's basically porn without the sex. Like, picture a porno flick and then cut out all of the sex scenes and you have Vampiros Lesbos. It's really terrible. It's not good. There are some sexual moments in this movie, but they're very, very brief. And the rest is just terrible. And what do I mean by this feels like porn without the sex? I'll give you an example on how the plot feels very porn-like. So this girl goes on a business meeting, and she meets the client who she's supposed to talk business with. And the client immediately says, oh, I'm too tired to talk about business now. Do you want to just go skinny dipping? And it cuts to them skinny dipping. Dann gehen wir doch zusammen. Kommen Sie! Kommen Sie! Haben aber kein Badanzug! Sie schämen sich doch nicht vor mir. Haben Sie keine Angst, hier kann uns niemand sehen. And then they're naked on the beach. And they're like, don't you like it when the sand rubs against your naked body? But that's about it. You don't see sex. And guys, before you say it, Paul, you're just a horn dog. All you want is sex. If you were to give me art, give me the art. I love art. If you were to give me entertainment, give me all the entertainment. I'm a huge entertainment enthusiast. But if you're gonna give me none of those things, then I expect some exploitation of women for my pleasure. <laughs> you know, you gotta give me something here, folks. Yeah, I did say there are some brief sex scenes. This movie opens with a sex scene, if you want to call it that. It's basically this really odd striptease where this woman is the most inexperienced stripper I've ever seen in my life. It's like this is the first time she's doing it. And her signature move is to awkwardly crawl between a woman's legs. Like, she's like this. Uh, how do I... Can I just... Uh, and she's like awkwardly shifting her body. This movie probably had the budget of a potato. <laughs> Go on a Wikipedia or something, look up the film's budget, and you'll see budget colon potato. This movie has some of the worst dubbing. 
ever, die wieder zu sich gekommen sind. Na, wie geht es Ihnen? Sie fühlen sich besser als gestern, wie ich sehe. The blood looks like cheap acrylic paint you can get at Dollar Tree. <laughs> and the acting is very terrible. <laughs> and you know what else annoyed me about this movie is that the main actress in this looked familiar to me. I was like, who the, where the fuck did I see this girl before? <laughs> But turns out she just looks exactly like the girl in the the movie The Human Tornado. He made me do it. Bitch, are you for real? He made me do it. Bitch, are you for real? She looks like that woman. And you know what? I wouldn't care. I wouldn't care if this is shit. But it's pretentious as well. Yes, it's cheap, it's sleazy, it's dumb, it's not sexy. I had the opposite of a boner watching this movie. It just <laughs> into my body. But <laughs> this movie is also pretentious. Somehow it manages to be pretentious. Like the soundtrack is constantly using this like weird radio transmission noise. So like in the scene, it's completely random and you'll hear like, Hey, uh, this is all fun. This is coming to spur up in the pump, spur up, beep, 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 beep. And you're like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> and then there's like moments where there's like a weird hazy dream and it's randomly cutting to bugs. <laughs> And you're just like, why the fuck is this in the movie? Guys, please. I know these vampire marathons are supposed to be for fun. Skip out on this one. It was miserable. Do not attempt to watch this movie. Uh, I don't even recommend it to the lesbian community. <laughs> or the straight male community. It's not for any community. This is a terrible movie. Do not watch. Look away, do not watch. Okay, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Go get out of my face. Ugh, you better appreciate what I'm doing. Mm -hmm.